בעיתון העברי או בעיתון ה... All the people, all the people who were born in Germany in the 20s belonged somehow to the Hitler Youth. All the people in the age of Ratzinger of today, who are more than 75 years old, belonged to the Hitler Youth. All were imbued with Nazi ideology. But it doesn't uh, have to say that today they have to be or to stay National Socialist. The re-education took place already in the 40s and the 50s. So I don't believe that there is any, uh, any place or any room for doubt that uh, Ratzinger of today is very different from Ratzinger of the days where he belonged to the Hitler Youth. I hope that he will continue the same way and he will continue to build the same bridge as the last pope built in the past between the two nations, between the Christians and the Jewish nation. I bless the, him and I hope that he will continue the same way like the last pope. Even if there would have been um, aspects of his childhood that uh, would be uh, um, unfortunate and even deplorable, the mark of a person is how he or she behaves as an adult. And uh, to find something in that person's childhood that is negative and to make a mountain out of it seems to me to be uh, inappropriate. As an adult, he has shown a total rejection, categorical rejection of anti-Semitism, an understanding of its evil and of the danger, and a profound commitment to the well-being of the Jewish people. So one thing to oh, say really? Before. Oh, okay. At the U.S. Embassy? No, Israeli. Oh, really?